happening this morning, you'll need to watch your speed if you're driving past an Atlanta City School. Your risk of getting a speeding ticket increases today. Speed zone cameras are now fully operational near 10 City of Atlanta Public Schools. Love Lives Jerry Carnes is live near East Rivers Elementary School. Jerry, these cameras have become pretty common tools for slowing traffic down around schools all around Metro Atlanta. They have indeed, Cheryl. Good morning. And the Atlanta public school system is just getting started with this. Uh, right now, you'll find cameras outside of 10 Atlanta public schools, including the ones you see right back there outside of E Rivers Elementary. Eventually, uh, a dozen more schools will have them. The cameras and signs have been in place for about a month now as a warning. But when school starts this morning, the warnings are over. Watch your speed if you're driving through a school zone. In the city of Atlanta, there's now an extra set of eyes. Zip past E Rivers Elementary School, and it's not just parent Maximilian Hines watching. High traffic going through here. More eyes is probably better in this particular area. I don't know if people know around here that pedestrians have the right of way. E Rivers is one of 10 Atlanta public schools where speed zone cameras are now fully operational. They've been in place for a month, snapping photos of anyone traveling over the speed limit. The month long warning period is over. Those same speeders will now get a ticket. Atlanta joins the growing number of Metro Atlanta jurisdictions using cameras to enhance safety around schools. From Riverdale to Forest Park to Lawrenceville, where cameras captured one driver traveling 92 miles per hour through a school zone. Riverdale added school zone cameras last year. We have a lot of drivers that just uh, take the life of our kids for granted in the sense of the country speeding excessively 20, 25, 30 miles per hour over the speed limit. Whether it's the cameras in Riverdale or in Atlanta, the tickets generated will be for drivers traveling at least 10 miles an hour over the speed limit. And state law allows them to snare speeders for a brief period outside of school hours. If school starts at 8 o'clock, the cameras come on at 7, you can get a citation to one hour after the school has let out for educational purposes. In the city of Atlanta, it begins this morning. First with cameras outside of 10 schools, with more to come. Extra eyes all over to protect young students. All right, Jerry, changes starting today. What about the fines here? How much will people have to pay if they're caught speeding by one of those cameras? Now, the first time you're caught, you'll get a ticket that comes with a $75 fine. Each time you're caught after that, the fine goes up to $125. Back to you.